Hello guys, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I thought that uh, I would be speaking uh, some confusing words. Okay, some con confusing words for you. Uh, so one is excuse, the other one is apologize, third one is pardon, fourth one is forgive. So what are the differences in these words? So what are the differences among these words? Now, I'll tell you one thing. Now, recently, in a public forum, I remember uh, one person, okay, one person was selling the other person, okay, you have done so many blunders, so you have to excuse at first, not the exact words, but what I'm telling is the context, he was telling, you have done so many blunders in this country, so you have to excuse first. Is it correct or incorrect? That is incorrect. Why? If this person is going to excuse, the meaning is the offense was done by the others. So that particular person is going to excuse the others. The correct word for that uh, context is apologize. So you have to say you have done many blunders in this country, so you have to apologize first. Okay, so what is the difference between excuse and apologize? Now you know, uh, when you are going to enter somewhere, so maybe you want to uh, ask some person, one person to move, so you say, excuse me. So who is excusing? You or the other person? Uh, you say, excuse me, me. So, the excusing is done by the other person. Okay, when you say excuse me, so you are asking an excuse. Okay, so the other person is doing the excuse. But if somebody has done an offense to you, then what do you say? Do you say apologize me? You can't say apologize me, but you can say apologize to me. Okay, then, then who is sorry? In the first instance, when you say excuse me, who should be sorry? Huh? The person telling, the person telling excuse me should be sorry. And the excuse is given by the other person. When you say apologize to me, who, who should be sorry? The person in front of me. Okay, he should be sorry, so he has to apologize to me so that is the difference between excuse and apologize always remember if i say uh, so, but you can say like this you can say uh, excuse him so you are telling one mr samson excuse him showing another person so who is going to excuse that is mr samson who should be sorry the person in front of mr Samson or you can ask Mr. Samson apologize to him Okay, you can ask Mr. Samson apologize to him then who should be sorry? Mr. Samson Okay, so that is the difference. So uh, there are some uh, other uh, words like uh, say pardon. What do you mean by pardon? Hmm? Uh, yeah, pardon is again something like forgive so you can say Pardon me. Pardon me means mostly uh, just in a telephone conversation. If you don't hear something uh, from the other side, you can say, ah, pardon me. Pardon me, sir. Pardon me, madam. Like that. So that means that you didn't hear it. But you are still asking them to forgive you. Because uh, saying just like it's your flaw. Okay. So, pardon me, madam. Or in an interview. Okay. You, don't, you didn't hear any, something. They say. So you say, pardon me. Okay, it's just like sorry. Okay, it's just like sorry. So the pardon comes from French pardon. Okay, you know uh, now one day I told you that uh, English is heavily influenced with French. Okay, so uh, there are so many French words uh, that uh, have found their way into English. So pardon is such a excuse is also such a French word. Okay, they usually say excuse more. So that means excuse me. Okay, forget. Right. So, 
then what about forgive where do you use forgive now especially uh, you can say forgive me then who should be sorry i am sorry that is why i ask forgive me or when you are writing uh, say your uh, son was absent yesterday to the school so you want to write a letter to uh, his teacher you say please forgive master uh, say whatever name uh, your son's name okay so please forgive master so and so okay don't say please excuse that is you can write but that is not very proper okay excuse is just like uh, some little offense okay but you know being absent is not that uh, little offense okay so you have to say forgive forgive for his absence excuse his absence means that uh, you are just telling that it is not a big thing or like that okay that is not very nice okay so we discussed excuse and then apologize and then pardon and then forgive so what do you mean by sorry everybody knows okay so but uh, you know sorry can be mostly replaced with excuse me okay because when you say so just think that uh, you are got but but the, uh, the the difference is difference between excuse me and sorry is sorry is something that you don't do intentionally okay excuse is that you are doing something intentionally that means that you know that you are going to do that okay that is why i say when we enter a ho enter a room we say excuse me we don't say sorry okay we say excuse me because i know that i am going to disturb you excuse me but what about sorry huh? you go and uh, just think uh, that you know knock some person you didn't do it intentionally so you say sorry okay or you can say pardon me that's sorry and pardon are mostly the same meaning okay the only thing is that pardon has come from french right then don't ask me whether sorry is from uh, original english i don't know maybe or may not be because you cannot find the origins of words mostly uh, right so whatever now these are the uh, meanings of these words and how to use them correctly okay so uh, guys uh, thank you very much for watching my uh, youtube video uh, please share among your friends thank you very much have a nice day